Hey guys, uh, some people are asking how I made the water-cooled Xbox, so since I have taken it apart, because I'm adding something, I might as well show you how I did that. Um, I'm actually going to do a completely different setup than how it was in the last video, but here's the water block. It's from XSPC. It's made for the Xbox 360. It goes over the CPU and GPU, and uh, it's made to fit underneath the DVD drive. And this is the inlet and outlet is right here. I have 90 degree barbs on it. This is the pump. In the last video, the, uh, the pump had a acrylic uh, top to it so that you can add fluid to it. But I just recently got this reservoir from Excess PC, so I put the regular top back on this, and I'm going to be using this to add the water. There's the screw right there. So the setup now is probably going to be the pump here. It's going to pump into the radiator that I got from I don't remember the website, but uh, it's a two by forty millimeter radiator with two 40 millimeter fans and the pump and fans are both connected to a 12 volt that I soldered on the bottom of the motherboard they're all soldered to that so it'll pump into the radiator and pump out of the radiator come around here into the water block right there it runs through the water block and then it's going to come out this barb here and go out the back. I, have, I cut the metal casing out here. It's going to come out there and go into the... the uh, these are the barbs that were on the pump in the last video. But because I put the regular top back on, I don't need those on the pump. So I put them on here. I think these are a 3 8 inch. 3 8 inch tubing here so it'll this is the inlet and this is going to be sitting right here on top of the DVD drive with the inlet and outlet facing backwards so when it comes out of the water block it's going to come around here into the inlet here and then the outlet of the reservoir will come back around into the inlet of the pump and then it pumps it back through I also have this fan here, which has this connection here. This is the one with the, it's got LEDs here, and you can actually connect it through USB to your computer and type whatever you want it to say as it spins. It like displays, and in between each message that you put on there, it, it uh, displays the temperature of the air, not the actual Xbox but of the air that's passing through the fan. So that's pretty much it. I got the pump, all the barbs, the radiator, the two fans, and all the tubing from aqua tuning, that's what it's called. And the water block and reservoir were from accesspc.com. And uh, when I got the pump on aqua tuning, it came with the acrylic top. I just put it back in this box here if you want to see. It came with this acrylic top, but I don't need it now. I might be using it later for another Xbox that I'm going to be water cooling this Halo Xbox here might be using it for that one this is my personal xbox that so it's more for like experimenting different water cooling stuff and then this one might actually be for sale so if you have any other questions just please leave a comment thanks for watching